bigger wheels, a louder stereo, perhaps a panoramic sunroof. These are the sort of optional extras we're used to seeing furnish the spec sheets of our cars. But, much like our cars, some optional extras are a little more extra than others. Here's seven of the most outrageous optional extras ever offered. Let's start by putting some stars in your eyes, courtesy of the overlords of opulence, Rolls Royce. The Starlight Headliner is an optional extra introduced by Rolls Royce in 2007 for its Phantom model. And, as the name suggests, it's a headliner that appears to twinkle like a starlit sky. This is achieved by two Rolls Royce craftspeople who thread between 800 and 1600 individually adjustable fibre optic strands through the leather headliner in order to replicate the aesthetic of a night sky full of stars. Every starlight headliner is unique and personalisable, and in early 2018, Rolls Royce introduced the option of adding shooting stars to the headliner too. Prices for this optional extra start at around £9,000, but can climb much higher. This optional extra puts Rolls Royce in common with a car you would not expect, as the Vauxhall Adam also offers the same option. For £335, Vauxhall will fit 64 adjustable LED lights into the roof of your new city car, and whilst the effect isn't nearly as impressive as that of the Rolls Royces, it is a fun feature and makes a top talking point. Whilst we're on the topic of affordable options, here's another. The Fiat 500L is by no means an outrageous car, however, the concept of having a coffee maker built into your car is, and for £169? Fiat will do just that. The Lavazza 500 espresso machine sits between the driver and passenger seats and can make you a fresh cup of coffee in around two minutes. All you need to do is add the water and the coffee pods. Perfect for those early morning commutes. But what if you don't want your car smelling of stale coffee and having a piece of scented cardboard hanging from your rear mirror is just implausible? Well, fear not because Mercedes-Benz has you covered. The Mercedes-Benz Air Balance Package, introduced to the S-Class in 2013, allows for a bottle of Mercedes perfume to be held in the glove box, which can then be distributed around the car using the air conditioning system. There are four scents available, and the intensity of the scents can be altered to suit the noses of those in the car. The cost for this option is £360, which, as far as Mercedes options go, isn't so expensive, but when you consider that for the same price, you could buy a 30 year supply of Magic Tree air fresheners, it's not exactly economical either. But cars aren't always about economy. Case in point, the Bentley Bentayga. The Bentley Bentayga has a base price of £136,200. However, by adding just two optional extras, you can increase the cost of the car to over £330,000. So, firstly, may I present to you, at a cost of £80,000, the Bentley Bentayga Fly Fishing Kit. Created by Mulliner, which is Bentley's in-house customization studio, similar to MSO for McLaren or Q for Aston Martin, the set features four fishing rods, two nets, a tackle station, a waterproof trunk to store your wet waders, and of course a refreshment case, which houses flasks and even fine china tableware. The entire kit can be removed from the boot and used as seats too. That way you can sit, have a warm drink, and survey the lake you probably own. Bentley didn't stop there though. For those to who £80,000 is simply pocket change, the Bentayga has another, even more expensive option. It's a clock, made by the luxury watch manufacturer Breitling, that sits on the dashboard. The clock is machined out of solid gold. It's available with either a black ebony or mother of pearl face and is decorated with eight diamonds. And in order to wind, the dashboard spins the clock three times every 15 minutes, just to add a bit more spectacle. The cost to add this timepiece to your car? £150,000. So it's up to you. 
one optional extra, or a brand new McLaren 570S. Or, for £150,000, you could currently buy around 40 Pontiac Aztecs, the vehicle of choice for science teacher turned drug lord Walter White in the hit TV show Breaking Bad. The Aztec was labelled by its makers as quite possibly the most versatile vehicle on the planet. Pontiac gave the car four-wheel drive and aimed sales at adventurous young couples. And there was one optional extra on the Aztec that shouted adventure more than any other. The car's built-in tent. Yes, you heard correctly. When purchasing new, you could spec your Aztec to include a tent that attached to the rear of the car, allowing it to become an SUV camper van crossover. Versatile indeed. And if you added the custom fit Aztec inflatable bed to your options list, you were set for the ultimate adventure. And finally, but by no means least outrageous, optional extra number seven. It's about car seats. Usually, you'll find them upholstered with cloth, leather, maybe Alcantara, with some options for quilting or contrast stitching. However, Russian car company Darts took things a mile further when they announced that you could spec your million pound Prombron armoured car to have its seats upholstered entirely with whale penis leather. Darts announced that they were offering this option in 2009 However, after an international uproar and criticism from Greenpeace, the WWF, and even Pamela Anderson, the car company chose to drop the option and vowed not to use natural leather at all. A win for the whales? Well, not exactly. In 2013, Darts unveiled a Black Snake Edition Prombron to the Chinese market, along with which whale penis leather seats were once again an option. And if that wasn't quite to your taste, they also offered snakeskin, ostrich, crocodile, or even white sharkskin interiors. So much for Dart's 2009 press release, in which they described whales as their sea brothers. So, that was seven of the most outrageous optional extras ever offered. I hope you enjoyed it and feel slightly more informed than you did ten minutes ago. Thanks.